Hello and welcome back to our franchise mode today in La Casa de la Tierra number. I have no idea. I, I totally lost track on which episode it is. But today, um, you've already seen last episode that we finished most of the stuff, um, you know, uh, some small things and we've put uh, some of the small exhibits down. But as I promised, we will move on with this boring area over here, which is not yet done. Um, this will be in today's episode. You've seen that from the thumbnail already. It's going to be the Indian Rhino. But before we skip over to the Rhino, let me show you what I've done here. So this is my polar bear habitat. In case you haven't seen the speed build of it, I will put a link now to the top right and then you will be able to catch the speed build of that one. But this is a blueprint you can actually download um, from the workshop. It's not like 100% fitting into the tropical set here, but I thought, you know what, um, one of those uh, crazy things we need in our zoo. And, you know, with all the with all the stuff over here, the uh, water purification system, which is hidden in here, as you can see, there's like a whole system that is going through that wall. And we have this whole solar panels, actually with um, some wonderful mechanics on top of it. They're just constantly checking those solar panels are uh, providing the energy so it's it's kind of realistic um not like 100% but it's still uh, pretty damn good I guess um, and so we need uh, two polar bears actually um, the size of the habitat is nearly the one they need so um, I'm, I'm quite happy about this and I've put some you know some foliage around just to just to bring it in uh, just to make sure it is uh, somewhat what is even going on here so I no no not 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 like that one I need the Polar bear, there you go. I have no idea what kind of polar bears we've in here. So they're like not like even that expensive though. I'm, I'm like not sure, you know, that's fine. Frontier Zoo, let me get that one. And a female one, this is this is pretty good. What about this one though? No, that's fine, let's let's take that one too. Okay, we got these two already. That was um, fairly easy. Oh wait, we did already have one. Um, we've got a baby, baby one. Um, Yoskolo from my Ruazu, actually. Oh, I did not. I did not know. Um, but I think it's fine to bring this even in with. And then as soon as it's... You know, it's it's not their, it's not their parents then. So we can actually bring them all in. And then as soon as our friend is grown up, uh, we can get rid of the actual polar bear we bought. And then so it can still go together with the female one. Let's check which one is the better one. It's definitely, it's definitely the new one. Okay, never mind. So we have some, we have some, some, some potential to skip some things and stuff. Uh, now we definitely have to check what is happening before we start with the Indian Rhino. I have a very special, wait, wait, no, 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 wait a second. There is like none on it. So it, it will be in a second. Uh, okay, water treatment inaccessible. Oh yeah, that one. So let's just uh, yeah yeah. This is just for this is just for beauty reasons. Okay, so this is not like uh, actually there. Who's actually visiting us? Oh my lord, look at that! I'm visiting myself again. Uh, let's say hello quickly to all the people. Uh, gorilla's about to inbreed. Yeah, well, just do it. Um, I'm too lazy to check this right now, and we need some baby gorillas anyways to get some. Uh, conservation credits, so that should be fine as well. Um, did I did I just say hello to everyone now? Uh, I guess I did. Right. Yeah. 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 Okay. So the gorilla did inbreed. That's fine. Dangerous fighting. Still chimpanzee. I'm just gonna straight away ignore that, to be honest. Um, simply because reasons. <laughs> no, but I'm just like. Um, okay. We have to check if there's anyone on the way already to deliver to deliver the animals because they will be delivered into here. Oh wait, actually. Where is this wall coming from? What is this wall even? Because that could cause some issues. Let's oh wait. We, we I think it's enough to just delete that lower wall. Um, not sure why exactly I had this still in. Me being bad person. Me being bad person. Okay, is there anyone in? Uh, they should be in transit, right? They should be in transit now. I guess they need to run a run, like a super long way until they're there. Oh God, look at all the gharials. I'm still afraid of the moment when they're all grown up because then we have to sell like like everyone um trade center trade center wait why are they just not here like i don't i don't get this they need to be they need to be brought in here so delivery scheduled okay so are they just not not bringing them in because honestly though i mean these are not the ones I had, like I, I put them in, but in transit to habitat. Okay, see, that's that's a good one. That's a good one. Can I move them both? No, I cannot, but I can, I can say, here you go. 
Wait, no, they are already in the move. Okay, so this is okay. Um, let's have a look if they if they brought them already over here. No, they didn't. Is this like such a long way? I mean, I mean, we can just you know what we could do. We can just throw in uh, some caretakers, just easily. You know, just like that, and I'm just hoping because as I remember, there should be like a trade center in there. Um, animal is stressed. Yeah, but I mean, then just go somewhere where you're not stressed because <laughs> because I I mean I mean okay. Water tier in yeah, it's still inaccessible. I understood, but it's it's non-operational, so don't give me that. Like, just don't give me that info anymore, okay? I mean, I could disable the info, but are they still not in? Like, seriously? Like, I mean, hello? Is the animal delivered yet? No, it's not. I'm still wondering why they're not delivering. I mean, the pathway should be connected, right? Is it yet connected? It, it definitely is connected, right? So there's definitely no connection. So boom. It doesn't matter, right? I mean, I can, I can just say, hello, let's, let's put this one down. And it's connected over here. It's all connected over here. Then it goes all the way here. It's also connected. No, it's all connected. So there, there shouldn't be an issue here. I mean, it's it's quite a long way. Oh, there's someone running. Okay, so oh, there are the three ones coming. They came a long way. They came a long, long way. Holy crap. Okay, so this is interesting. Very interesting indeed. Now we're already six and a half minutes in, um, and I haven't even even started with the new one. I'm just going to quickly check um, that the that the polar bears are doing good, and then we are starting with the Indian rhino. Um, so, uh, yeah, uh, we have to, we have to see what this, 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 uh, kind of, uh, brings in, but yeah, we will, we will see, um, how this turns off. Okay. So, uh, they are brought in here. Oh, look at that. And all of a sudden the, uh, billboards are displaying for whatever reason now, but, um, yeah, I, I think this should go away as soon as, as they are delivered because then they are not placed incorrectly anymore. Right. So see, that's what I meant all gone now it's all gone and in a, in a split second the people should actually be running over here as well one thing though I totally forgot uh, which is not in the blueprint and again bad me um, the main reason why I always forget this is because in sandbox you, you're just you don't put down donation boxes because it's I don't know you just don't think about it okay so this is the main reason why I always keep forgetting this and I never find this in here I just always need to you know bring this in okay let's let's plot then down all of the place here um, because there are like so many viewing potentials uh, across the whole zoo and across all these areas that I need to just uh, you know spread them everywhere this habitat and you know this habitat was was a pain to build but it was also fun to build so there are like so so many different areas where they can go um, and we have to see if everything just works fine because this dew look at that they're just doing very well indeed temperature should also be fine they cannot escape awesome like space wise is not like perfect but it's it's decent enough to keep them happy um where is the small one there's a small one look at that they have this little cave here just want to check that they also cannot escape because sometimes the small ones have a bit of an issue um funny enough that they still don't have enough space it's kind of insane but yeah so i'm wondering if if like a lot more people are coming now into the back area of the zoo because like polar bears should be pretty interesting for them um, but they have to find their way there, right? Uh, I, I mean, what we could do, we could do some marketing. I think we've never de done some marketing. So let's say uh, we are just doing a TV commercial comedy show, okay? So we're gonna do this and we are also going to do... Um, yeah, I think that's, that's what we're already doing. But let's do also like a family hour as well. And that one as well. We, we have the money, okay? We can only have three. That's a bit of an unfortunate thing. Um, but yeah, we've spent quite a lot of money into this. Um, oh, it's gonna be raining soon. It's gonna be raining. That's unfortunate for our build though. Um, because light and raining. <laughs> okay, we're gonna have to wait quickly until uh, yeah, the, the lighting is a bit better because I hate building in these conditions. It's, it's such a pain. Mm, can we just at least wait until there's a bit more light? No, no, it's gonna start raining here. Okay, I'm just gonna speed up the whole process a little bit. Hoping that at least we get some clear air, uh, clear air soon. Clear air, yeah, that's that's what I meant. Um, clear conditions is the better word, I guess. Common ostrich head offspring, awesome. Western lowland gorilla. This is our <laughs> this is our inbred uh, animal. 
Gabriel is about to mate. Not again. Um, uh, whatever. We have to get rid of all the Gabriels anyways at, at some point. I think that's the easiest way of doing it. Just get rid of them all at once. And then it's like, okay, you know, um, just get some new ones. I think that's the easier way of doing it rather than just like trying to... Yeah, yeah you are stressed. I know. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Hello, weather. Can you... Can we just... You know, can, can the weather just... A zebra, yeah, I just do inbreeding. At this point, I, I couldn't care less. Like, it's it's fine. I mean, <laughs> it's it's just let, let them do that thing. Um, because, for those of you... I mean, this is, this is a special thing for those people who watch the entire episode um, and don't skip through the video. This uh, zoo over here will be ending soon. So I, I think it will be two, three more episodes. We are going to do a full tour. And then we start a new franchise. Something that I haven't been... Um, I haven't seen too many people been doing so this will be something completely new and I'm gonna I'm gonna tell this at the end of today's episode because we will need some cool assets from you guys again so we will do the same thing as over here uh, in terms of the community how they can step in and, and help doing stuff but um, yeah for for this there will be a specific question from my side and uh, yeah this will be this will be quite interesting okay let's do what I wanted to do here the whole time, and this is going to be the uh, Indian Rhino area first, and then we are going to do the Indian Elephant area after this one. So first of all, what we're going to do, we are going to put down again our little um, stuff facility hub, which we need. Uh, I think it's, yeah, it's gonna go, it's gonna get right into the middle here, because it's, it's going to be a bit more different this time. So this is going to be here. Um, no, actually, let me just rotate that this way. And we're gonna have like a big staff room here. Um, not sure if we need two of those, by the way. Anyways, we are going to have like a, a water treatment to this side and a transformer to that side too, right? This is, this is great. And then let's connect this already with the path because that's gonna be interesting uh, how we do this anyway. So yeah, whatever. I'm not sure like why is this even why is this even like having curbs on on the ground? Not sure why it had had the curbs on the ground. No one knows, right? Uh, we do need to connect that one too, right? Yeah, no, actually, could you please? Yeah, yeah, there you go. Like this and whatever. It doesn't have to look like perfectly stellar, fine, whatever. Can we just uh, align this? No, we cannot. Okay, so let's just pop one here connect this it's it's somewhat straight okay it's somewhat straight so this is going to be this little bit where we go okay and then what we need to do now we are going to have like a huge plaza in the middle here so this is going to be this is going to be the uh, main plaza of that area i'm going to just make this like a roundish thing we're going to have the indian rhino on this side and we're going to have the indian elephant on that side so what we're going to do actually i have to relocate the plaza a little bit it's my mistake here. Uh, do the plaza a bit more over here because it's going to be like a little. Yeah, yeah, that's a lot better. And then we are driving. We are driving uh, this path over here. We just drive in these a little bit closer to this area here, just to make sure that we make the most of the space available. Like this. There you go. And then it's going to be forwarded exactly like this. There you go. Now we just. Uh, just come here where we wanted to come and uh, one thing we need to do now we are just going to bring a little bit of a small area here in the middle so this is going to be flattened to surface um, not really quite sure though maybe we need to get even a little bit deeper let's do it that way and now I'm just going to dig uh, somewhat like a tunnel that goes here. Uh, but don't worry, it's going to be like an actual tunnel uh, once this is done. I just want to make sure that this will be the main viewing platform they have. And it's going to have two layers, actually. So therefore, I need to also make sure that the terrain... Mm, okay, I think we... Yeah, I think we can just dig that. No, actually, we need to go higher then. Uh, I'm just gonna do it that way. That should be easier. There you go. Uh, I need to, I need to, you know, improve this uh, in a bit. But first of all, we're just going to do it that way, and then uh, let me just have the key. Yeah. Well, no, that's not how it should be. My mistake. Uh, I go to five meters. Five meters. There you go. And just going to create. Uh, is that not? 
seriously. Okay, let me just see. I think we need to go even more into this direction anyway, so that should be fine. There you go. This is where we go. And then uh, what I need to do, we just need to have the Q going. No? Q going here. There you go. And then having that one go down. See, this is why I need to make the terrain go away a little bit. I just need to make sure that this all comes together exactly as I want it. So there you go. And uh, no, wait, there you go. And just bring that down again. I, ca I cannot make these stairs. Uh, I, I will show you in a bit why. Um, no, 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 terrain, 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 terrain. Just pull that a little bit away. And then the path goes again. No, not here. So just a little bit around the corner. And and that should be enough that should be enough already so what we're gonna do now is we're just going to delete this and then uh, we are doing this all the way through here just like always select that one hello uh, I'm gonna delete this like so and then just we can actually also make like this path work and then we can actually go from here and just delete all these things step by step. I think over here we need to do it. Oops, uh, I was one too many. I uh, just deleted it that way to create the connection. I'm not sure if, nope, that didn't work well. I'm gonna delete this here as well and then connect it again. There you go, making that a little bit smaller. And well, that doesn't matter right now. We will connect this later because now I will put this bigger one. Huh, we can even go bigger. Oh no, actually same mistake again. Just need to make sure that this goes like around this thing again in here. Yep, exactly like this. Please connect. And then we just bring this path all the way back here. And it's going to be the interesting bit here. We need to make sure that this works. And yeah, I think, uh, this might even be too early. I want to make sure that this is like a really, really, really nice staircase that is just at the very end here. Uh, because I don't want to waste too much space, to be honest, so... Yeah, no, that doesn't work. You know what we could do? You know, in this case, in this specific case over here, I think I'd like to, first of all, make this smaller, and then we just go with the elevation step. There you go. I think that should be the best thing to do. Just go one up. Uh, nope, sorry. Just go one down. One straight. Um, the reason why I'm doing this, guys, is just simply to... No, actually, you know what? Uh, we just do this, and then... Hello, sorry. Go down. Go up. Go down. Go up. And go down. There you go. So this is the only way we can do it. Now let's straighten this quickly. And then connect it. Awesome. This is exactly what I wanted. It doesn't even matter if it's a little bit roundish. Uh, because now we can basically just connect this a little bit more easy here. Looks a bit more clean. That's exactly what I wanted. And now we should actually be quite easily connected to here. And yeah, that can be a bit bigger. Why not? I mean, I wanted to go with the smaller one, but that's fine. So we have the connection down here. Um, and, and what we do now is going to be very interesting. So first of all, we're just going to delete all this terrain over here. Oh, well, that doesn't work. Oh, that's not that's not too much of a problem. So I'm gonna delete all this here. So there you go. This is all fine. And yeah, we're just going to make this also a bit more nice. There you go. Just smooth the corners a bit. I think you can actually tell already what this is going to be. Um, but again, just making sure that this looks nice in the end. Um, we are now going to use the barrier here and this will be also the main part of the habitat anyhow. So uh, let's keep that one. Actually flat top, that should be fine. And then where's that? Where's that little, there you go. This is that bit what I wanted. And then just dragging that thing all over here. Eh, there you go. And I'm not sure if we need it any more than that. No, I, I don't think we need. Uh, what we do here, obviously, we're just going to put in the water, which uh, I think, wait. No, 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 no. Um, okay, maybe, maybe we need to drag this a little bit more then, just to make sure that we can get the maximum amount of water in here, which I want. Uh, nope, still does, wait, this does work. Wait, that's like a joke, right? Okay. Um, it's decent though, but where is the... 
I want to get to this height, guys. I, I really want to. So I think what we need to do here is we just need to build this barrier over here as well. And then we just raise all of that again, making sure that this works. There you go. And now let's do the terrain again. Yeah, there you go. This works. This works. I'm not even sure if that's enough water for them, but for the moment, I'm quite happy with how this is looking. And now let's drag this all the way down as much as we can. Great. Okay, so this is what we have. And this will be like a little um, spot where the people can watch. There will be some glass things around here. We're going to basically use these buildings um, in the habitat as shelters. They are just so awesome looking and we can basically use them this time. And also I'm, I'm, I'm really wanting to, to use that piece. Uh, even though I will have to alter this a little bit uh, from the design itself, uh, but that's fine. And we have this semi-broken one, which I also like so much. I think they are still from, I think Haribo made all of these. Um, at least I wouldn't be surprised uh, that it was him, but yeah. So this is what we do. And now what we, what we will have to kind of come up with is a way to uh, connect those both sides here. So what we do, we're just going to build like a terrain bridge um, and we are... The biggest task will be to kind of make sure that this is part of the habitat in, in a natural looking way. Um, so the problem, the biggest problem as always about this is we have to find exactly the one sweet spot uh, where the lowest part is that works. So this is already, I think this is already the lowest part we can, we can work with. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to just make sure that there is enough terrain all over the place to make sure that this is all hidden away. And now we have to kind of alter that in so it doesn't look so massive, you know. Um, just gonna, gonna make sure that this looks almost natural enough here. Just going to, yeah, just bring in some other more hilly parts into the habitat, just not making this all too weird and stuff. It's just going to make this like so. Mm, and I'm even willing to just have some more terrain in here. I want to even hide this part, you know just to make sure that this is all hidden away as much as we can. I hate that the pathway has such an incredible hitbox. It's insane. Like, uh, how big you want to go, yes, um, that's, like, super crazy. Um, yeah. I want to make sure that this most part of it is hidden in, in terrain, because I'm, I'm, like, not willing to build so much stuff around here. So, yeah, I guess that's, that's what we need. Um, so that is uh, kind of great. So let's have a look. Let's have a look what that looks like. So there you go. And we can still put some glass in between here. I still want to make this kind of open. You know, that's that's fine to have like a glass roof in here. I'm gonna build this in a split second. I would love to get rid of this uh, terrain bit here. Um, I'm not sure if I can do it if I delete the path. Let's quickly do this and see if that helps. Because I hate I, that this looks like like super ugly. Let me just see if if this works. No, just partly though. What is that even? Like, where is this coming from and why can I not delete it? Wait, is there any way I can... Oh, wait, 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 we just, first of all, uh, create the path again. There you go, come on. Just, just connect here. There you go. And we're gonna connect this one as well. Awesome. And, um, ah, you know what? We're just gonna put something else in front of it, okay? We're just gonna put something else and then that should be fine. Now let's go to construction and we're going to say uh, glass and we are going to use a roof piece, which is the, yeah, let's, let's take the semi roundish one. Is there another one with a better texture though? This one, oh, wait, it is in there. Oh, okay, cool. That's, I thought it wasn't available in this glass, but it is. So yeah, let's, let's do this. And we gotta, we gotta, we gotta do this with another trim, uh, which doesn't need to be glass, by the way. But I uh, want to make sure that this looks a little bit more, yeah, like the contact has to be made, you know, there has to be like a, a proper contact. Uh, this one should work. Let's see. Uh, wait, no, that's the wrong thing we have here. That should work. Is that connecting? It almost looks like. Uh, what about just rotating that again and having this from the inner side as well? Yeah, it looks a lot better. That looks a lot better. And then we need something to the lower side of it. Um, let's rotate this piece. I cannot put this in the middle, can I? I can, okay, cool. And then we're just going to drop this down here, like so. Look at that. And then can we just rotate this a little bit? Um, that should be fine. 
There you go. And if we copy that around, you will not be able to see it even more. That's great. Okay, let's copy it. Wait, is it not the same height again? I hate the game for doing that. Um, yeah, let's let's go for four. Let's go for four. There you go. And now we're just going to make sure that this sits somewhat nicely on that roof. Great. And I'm just going to copy this. Bring that in here. And there you go. This should be where it is. There you go. Just slightly overlapping. And yeah, we can... You can, you can tell that this looks already kind of cool. I want to make sure that there is like, okay, so we are, we are going to make sure that we're using some of these rocks here. Um, even though I know that they are not like the perfect ones for the Indian Rhino, but uh, we are still in a tropical biome and therefore we need to alter some things sometimes, you know, and therefore I'm just going to bring some rock work in. I don't know, so that should be good like this and then you have this viewing opportunity down here which <laughs> still is that ugly little thing here I have no idea what exactly this, this should be but um, whatever okay cool uh, the next bit we have to do is this little thing over here and this is where we put now our main effort uh, I'm willing to just do this with the uh, rotation drink um, it's gonna give me the mud pillar and then uh, we go from here I'm just too lazy to do anything else, so uh, let's do it that way. And just bring these two in, one and two. And now let's type in glass, and we're going to use, actually the glass piece we just got. Um, that should be fine. So let's, uh, there you go. And then, yeah, that's, that's the straightest one we can get. Let's bring the zip, a, like so. And I'm gonna I'm gonna stick to the thatch idea. You know that's that's what we need to do. Uh, let's call this beam, and we're going to use this beam. Oh, and you know you know what? They cannot climb, so we're going to use this wonderful lock piece. Uh, that one. Oops, that's the weird way to do it. See so here, go, and go back to construction, and then we have the uh, blah blah blah. How is it called again? Wood fence? No, I think it's fence still. The one piece I'm looking for. Fence, 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 fence. No, it's not in here. Okay, so let's type in wood again. There is this particular like wooden little, I think, yeah, that, that one looks cool too. Uh, we can actually use this one. So to the other sides, this is even kind of cool so that they don't come too close to the, uh, to the, to the mirror. I'm just gonna pull this down a little bit further. And then it makes sense to also have like this thing doubled like so and just move this down a bit more so as if this is like a kind of a additional uh safety thing um to to these animals and then uh, i think oh this is what well, that's, that's weirdly big um didn't expect that to be that big uh we've got this thatch thing we're gonna put this in the middle later on but first of all let's just type in thatch and we've got this roof it's like a, we have we have these three thatch pieces we've got this roundish one okay so we're gonna have to look at some point into how to make this like they have proper big ones is this like big enough maybe already for it that's like that's like already big enough right so we can actually have this already on top and then yeah you know what i'm just gonna pull this up here uh just to make sure there's no no confusion going on um by the way we can just delete those two see that we have the right um distance in between yeah, I think we can just easily kind of move this a little bit better so that there is no big deal. There you go. Can delete this one piece in the middle. Copy that once more. That looks fairly decent to me. Uh, okay, that was one too much, but that's okay. And now let's do the copy paste action. Yeah, now let's do this without and see how far we come and if this somehow fits mystic mysteriously. Uh, which it does and I'm confused, but I take that I I just definitely take this. Okay um, This was meant to be exactly like this. Okay, so yeah, this is what I was thinking maybe but how many of those? Oh, I copied them with me <laughs> That's kind of fun. Uh, never mind though. We are just taking this roof still. I'm just going to I'm just going to copy those things like this like That and Like that and then we're just going to lazily Put another one in the middle just on top like this and then it kind of looks good already yeah that's that's how it is you have this this insane viewing platform here 
uh, which uh, we have to definitely delete this piece in the middle and then we kind of create the entrance. Uh, it doesn't need to be that much of an entrance anyhow, but well, I'm just doing it that way. And the rest will now be covered with stones, uh, just to make sure that this is uh, kind of nicely covered in. And we're just taking these boulders here, look a little bit of an Indian appeal to it. Why not? You know, making sure that this kind of works. It, you know, it's incredibly ugly though. Um, gotta gotta admit this, um, but uh, I, I don't have the time in franchise. This will change a little bit, guys, in uh, the next project. I'm gonna talk about this as I promised at the end. We are nearly at the end, though, of this episode. Um, uh, well, okay. So 30 minutes in, oh, I think we can still we can still do some stuff in here. But first of all, let me make sure that we can now put in the barriers, and we are just going to to use the. Um, the stone barrier first. It's going to be a little bit more different in the end, but first of all, let's put this down and we're going to take the concrete wall, just making sure that the height is already put to like uh, three meters, that should be fine. And now we're going, even though I like this wall, we're just going to use the concrete one and we're going to use the rounded shape, obviously. And we're just going to bring this around here. Uh, I wanna have this stick to the ground. It goes all over here, just making that turn, curving nicely to the pathway. I'm not like exactly sure what I will do over here. I want to make sure, first of all, that they don't see the animals too much already. Um, not really sure. Maybe you guys have some ideas. You can comment them down below to make sure that we have a certain idea what the rhinos can do with their space. But for the moment, I want to keep... Wait, why is that not... Oh, that's why. Yeah, never mind then. <laughs> Are you kidding? Oh wait, it should work if I... yeah, exactly. So this is what we needed to do. Let's raise this thing quickly up and then put this one into a solid thing like that too. And uh, we are going to go with this background, as always, just trying to merge that into a green tint that matches our area here. Ah, uh, it should be definitely a lot brighter though. Uh, let's just get in. Um, that looks a lot better. Okay, that matches, you know, it kind of vanishes in the background. Again, it's not like super nice, but it's. I think it's fine. Um, and as this is the habitat now mainly done, uh, we will need to find some, some ways of hiding that nicer um, in here later on. I, I could make some ditches and stuff, you know. Actually, you know what? I think I will do this quickly. I think I will just do some, some awesome ditches here. Uh, intensity all the way up, yes, and then I don't know if two is... And sorry for the harsh cut here, but I had so many issues in the past couple of days with my Premiere Pro. I really do hope that the uh, um, you know episode is able to be rendered right now, because obviously um, there seemed to be an issue at the end of the day with this file specifically. I still don't know why. I don't see any any particular issue here. But anyhow, I really hope it uh, is going to be rendered. If it is going to be rendered for today, for Wednesday, uh, you'll see this episode and you will be able to catch me live tonight on that other channel. Uh, in case you want to and we are going to play some summer lake and also if you enjoyed this episode uh, make sure to hit that subscribe button if you want to stay here and also make sure to comment uh, what you want to comment down below and i really hope that you guys have a good time stay safe everyone and goodbye